Littlefinger, played by Aidan Gillen, was brutally killed off in Game of Thrones Season 7. The devious trickster met his end when he crossed Arya, Maisie Williams, and Sansa Stark, Sophie. Turner, one time too many, Arya sliced his throat in a merciless killing in a moment that will be treasured by fans of the HBO hit for years to come. Now, Aiden has teased the final season of Game of Thrones, suggesting the ending will certainly leave viewers reeling. The 49-year-old said, I'll be excited to see the end of Game of Thrones. Not sad, I'll be watching and hoping there's still room for lots of surprises, it'll probably be devastating, I hope so anyway, although I'm not working on it anymore, that's beside the point, the experience will always be there, it's spliced into my life. Aiden told The Independent, does this tantalizing tea suggest there is danger to come for the heroes of the show. This comes after a new theory emerged suggesting Jon Snow, Kit Harrington, will be betrayed with huge consequences. Jon and New Flame, Daenerys Targaryen, Amelia Clarke, captured a white to take to Cersei Lannister, Lena Headey, in a bid to gain her trust, although the pair are convinced the Iron Throne holder will loan her army to them in order to defeat the Night King, Vladimir Ferdic. However, many fans believe the rows will backfire on them as they find themselves betrayed by Jon's Northern Army. Reddit user Daryl the Duane suggested, We all know that the Northerners will have an issue with Jon bending the knee and brining a Targaryen queen to the north. Yes, Jon may convince them, or the Whites themselves will by the Northern Lords seeing them for the first time, to get used to it, but what if some of them betray John? The forum user goes on to suggest the Lords could rebel and actually side with Euron Greyjoy, Pillow Aspak, in order to charge on Cersei. They believe Euron will then kidnap Sansa, Arya, or both, and take the mass a hostage to the evil queen. Will all of the remaining Stark clan make it out alive? Game of Thrones will return to Sky Atlantic next year.